This unit's been in development for uh, a couple of years now. It follows on from a number of earlier products within the AGD portfolio. Uh, we developed based on uh, 24 gigahertz antenna, Doppler radar. And the wonder of this one is that we've been able to shoehorn quite a lot of clever technology into what is a very compact unit for the market. Um, we believe this will be very um, easy for people to deploy and very flexible for people to set up in the field. And what do we use it for? It's used for detection of vehicles for multiple applications globally. The primary application maybe for intersection control. Uh, another application could be for temporary uh, traffic light control where you might have roadworks. The compactness is uh, very handy for that as well. But more importantly, there is an RS-42 feature whereby the radar can actually measure the speed of the approaching vehicles. And in that capacity, it's very good for use with uh, vehicle actuated signs. Now, lots of other companies are building similar products. What makes AGDs stand out? OK. We take a lot of pride in the provenance that we build into the vehicle detectors that we make. We've been making them for a number of years now. And we're trying to bring to the audience this year the story about the test equipment, the sophistication of the test equipment that we're using back at uh, Staverton. People coming to AGD often comment on, uh, we didn't know you did all that in the way of the test equipment that we have at our premises. All of the test equipment is bespoke for the particular families of radar that we're manufacturing. So we're able to simulate targets in our factory that the radar might see in the field. We're able to make a lot of sophisticated measurements on the radar's performance during that test cycle. That gives the provenance, the guarantee of performance, and certifies for the customer that the product is going to perform well in the field. And you're a British company, but I presume this radar could be used anywhere in the world? This radar, yes, as you say, could be used anywhere in the world. It's 24 gigahertz. That frequency is an approved band in many, many countries, many of those which we already operate in and many more which we'd like to go for in the future.